Okay, we're back. All right, I'm back from the track here the next day. So I was up there racing El Mirage dry lake bed, off-road vehicle park. And so on my pass, which I forgot to say how fast I went because I was a little bit hot, very hot actually, a little bit heat, heat prostration going on. So we're doing Bonneville, or I'm doing Elmer's, yeah, damn it. I'm doing SCTA racing, so that's this here. SCTA is El Mirage Dry Lake Racing, and then Bonneville is Bonneville Racing. It's all the same stuff, but it's two different names. So anyway, here's the um, timing slip for the run. <clears throat> it says it's only 89 degrees. Yeah, I had about 189 of my leathers. And I'm not sure, 5,400 foot elevation corrected, I guess. So it's only actually about 2,400, 2,350. So yeah, good air, normal. <clears throat> And then uh, after it cleaned out on the pass, which you could I watched the video, he shut it off before it even came on in low gear. I was still trying to get the thing running in low gear. My gearing is so tall, I think he shut the video off just as I was starting to come on the power in low gear. Anyway, once I got up in the second, I can turn the power on to it a little bit. It had some speed getting in the carburetor. It cleaned out the over rich condition and got running. But at the finish line, it stopped before it got down there. So it's right here <clears throat> so my problem is is the regulator took a crap so i plugged up a hole in it so i'm putting 28 pounds of pressure to my carburetor which is a little bit too much fuel pressure might be flooding it a little bit just a little but uh we're running 60 percent nitromethane in it so flooding is not always always a bad thing but anyway at the other end of the track the uh motor was uh, not too happy about it and uh it quit running a little bit Got about 80% power loss, like it was locking up. Lost about 500 RPM. Then it recovered. And I picked up another two to 250 of that back before I went through the traps. So the, but it still only came back to maybe 50, 60% power. When I tore it apart, there's nothing wrong inside because there's a lot of blow by, which is all the oil blowing by. The rings are obviously are not seated. But, uh, but anyway, that's what happened on that run. There you go.